So like the title says, uh, today I'm going to be trying to charge my laptop with a USB battery pack. Um, I have this uh, Anker PowerCore uh, 5000 that we're going to try and charge the laptop with. Actually, no. I know for a fact that this will not charge my laptop. This, however, this might charge my laptop. This is the uh, Rav Power 26,800 milliamp portable battery pack with USB C power delivery, 30 watts. Pick this up on uh, on Amazon on one of their Cyber Monday sales. Uh, picked it up primarily for traveling. This is 26,800 milliamps. So this is the maximum allowable size that you can carry on on a U.S. airline. The Federal Aviation Administration sets a uh, maximum portable battery pack size of 100 watt hours. Uh, this is about 99.16 watt hours. Hours. So this is basically the maximum size that you can carry on a U.S. airline. Uh, for you international customers, you'll have to check uh, with your airline to see if they have larger or smaller restrictions. But in the U.S., this is the maximum size. So this power bank supports USB-C power delivery and is capable of outputting 30 watts of power through the Type-C port. So we're going to... We're going to plug it in uh, to the laptop and we're going to see if it charges. Let me know in the comments down below what you think the answer is going to be. Is this going to charge the laptop or no? I actually don't know um, what I'm thinking. I've, uh, I've not tried this before. Um, this is brand new. Just got it today. So we're going we're gonna to plug it in and uh, we're going to see what happens. Let's see. So, wow, it, uh, it reports that it's charging. Wow, I am, uh, I'm honestly surprised. Now, I normally use a, uh, I normally use a 60 watt charger, um, to charge this computer, and this is only, this, uh, maximum power output is 30 watts. So I'm going to cut the video here. I'm going to do, uh, you know, a little light work on my computer, um, things I would normally do if I was in a situation that I would be using this to power my computer, you know, web browsing, things like that. And I'm going to see if this, if this actually does actively charge the battery. So we're at, uh, we're at 88% right now on the battery. And uh, we're going to see if this goes up or if it goes down while I'm using the computer. So I'm going to cut the video right here, and uh, we'll be back with the results. So guys, we are back. It's been just a split second for you, but it's been about 20 minutes here. And the, uh, the report is we are charging. So I'm not sure how well that shows up on the camera, but when I plugged the battery pack in, we were at about 88% battery. And in 20 minutes, we're up to 92%. So it does charge very slowly. Um, and that was why I was using the computer, you know, just doing some web browsing and things like that. Uh, but it will charge. I don't intend this to be a, a solution that I use regularly. Um, but, you know, if for some reason you find yourself without access to an electrical outlet and a dead battery and you need to do something on your computer... Portable USB battery pack that you can use to charge your computer. Rav Power 26,800 milliamp with 30 watt USB C power delivery. This charges my HP Spectre X360 13T. This is the late 2017 model with the 8th generation um, i7 processor. So your results may vary depending on how large your laptop battery is. Um, I know some of the 
the larger MacBooks, like the 15-inch MacBooks, um, typically use an 87-watt charger or a, maybe like a 90-watt charger. So again, this is only 30 watts. Um, so uh, it may charge them. If it does, it will charge them quite slowly. It, Of course, it charges this battery significantly slower too. I normally use a 60-watt charger with this computer, but in a pinch, uh, if you need to uh, bring the battery up on a computer like this, this can be a good solution for you. Hope this was helpful. If you enjoyed this video, click that like button, leave a comment down below, and we will see you next time.